I love this place. A place between happy and sad. A place to be and observe. It's not devoid of emotions. I merely witness them with no friction. Sometimes I have authority over them and can conjure a feeling. This feels creative and can inspire my imagination. My mind wanders imaginatively with a directionless focus. It thumbs through the pages, hovering for just a moment on the content. It doesn't judge, nor does it respond. It observes and ponders. It has a duality. Remembering, recalling, planning, organizing, constructing and wondering. It is also watching, listening, remaining neutral, accepting and subtly steering. There is more than one voice in my head and they fight for attention. The trick is to treat them all as equals and accept them for who they are. The critic, the lover, the rejected, the proud, the jealous. Lots can be learnt from the voices. They share hidden depths. They reveal to me the lessons I have learnt, the responses that have saved me, the responses that have not. The voices try to guide me. They have good intentions, but as all good intentions, they can be flawed. I look to the source of their existence to help me understand their protective nature, but do not let them influence my behaviour. Survival is learning to see these voices. Survival is the observing, listening, remaining neutral, accepting and subtly steering. When I'm surviving, my actions are guided by love and remain true to myself.